What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Bergs, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a um, what they don't want you to know for sign of Virgo for May of 2022. This resonates at Virgo in any aspects of your charts. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, or the moon, Jupiter your charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Leave the rest. Uh, my truth hidden is basically what someone in your life doesn't want you to know. It could be anybody. A friend, a neighbor, a lover, a former lover, a co-worker, former co-worker, etc., etc., etc. Anybody. Um, one message may apply. Two may apply. Two plus may apply. None may apply. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug the message or messages in how they resonate in your own personal life. If they do resonate, um, please don't force anything that doesn't fit. I just want to make that very abundantly clear. Okay. Um, this is for the sign of Virgo. I encourage everybody to check out their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or they behave nature your charts as well. And cross watchers are always welcome as well. Um, if you don't want to check out all those signs, I would at least um, encourage you to check out this uh, your sun, moon, rising, Venus, and north node signs. Um, just saying, just saying. Of course, you know, you don't have to if you don't want to. I did get one channel message as I was meditating on your um, truth hidden energy. And I heard uh, a third party situation is what I heard. A third party situation. So, um, obviously, I think that's what somebody in your life doesn't want you to know. Uh, I think they have you in a third party situation because this is your truth hidden. So I think um, if you're in a relationship like a boyfriend, girlfriend, fiance, common law or legally married situation, I think um, somebody out there has a third party situation, but they're trying to keep it very hidden from you. Um, if this resonates for you, um, I think it's your partner or, or partners. I think partner, but you plug it in how it resonates um, for go. Um, and you have the snake energy that pulled. So I think this person has been a, is being a snake to you that has you in the third party situation. Um, if that resonates for you, Virgo, um, only you know your story, not anybody else. If you are in a third party situation, they're obviously keeping it very, very sneaky um, and deceptive. So um, you might have to do some searching and re, uh, you might have to do some searching to find out if they really are in a third party. And I'm feeling heavy digging. Maybe receipts, uh, maybe bank statements, maybe text messages, emails, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but at least one of you guys, uh, you're in a third party. You just don't know it. And they've got a snake energy in here all day long with your third party situation. Number 37 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 37, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, number 37. And then you have the snake energy, you have endurance, third chakra, angel of divination, angel of heralds. Um, you could be just, for some, you could be dealing with the fire sign because it's fire sign energy with the snake energy. For some, your third party could be a um, fire sign that's got you in the um, third party. Um, or any other sign that's exhibiting the snake energy. Um, if it is a fire sign, they could have Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hamper, Jupiter charts, if that message applies for you, birds. A poisoning is about to become very, very, very significant in a Virgo's life. Oh my God, I got that out in Virgo's other reading. Um, I think it was the Gist in 96 reading. I heard of um, poisoning. So, there is a Virgo out there that is being slowly poisoned. I just want to throw that out there because I got that in Virgo's Gist in 96 reading. It was a Virgo masculine in that reading. Um, however, that resonates. There's a Virgo masculine out there being slowly poisoned by somebody they trust. And I'm just being straight up. I feel Virgo masculine really needs to hear that. I'm serious. Um, and it's been going on for years, apparently, according to that reading. If you feel that, uh, if you have Virgo masculine and you feel you're getting poisoned, I would check out that reading and maybe go get some lab tests done on yourself. If you're, hopefully you're still living. And I, I'm, I'm not trying to be funny. I'm serious um, to figure out what the hell you're being poisoned with. And I'm serious. I'm not trying to scare nobody. But if you feel that message resonates for you, I would go get some lab work done. And I'm serious. Of course, you can take the advice and leave or leave it. 
Um, but I heard a poisoning is about to come very significant in Virgo's life. So this could be you being poisoned, Virgo, or somebody you're connected to. You could be a masculine or feminine, but some kind of poisoning energy in Virgo's reading again. Um, whether you're the one being poisoned or somebody you're connected to, you're about to find out they're poisoned, or maybe it's a cold case energy and you're about to find out somebody was poisoned and this, um, a dead body was poisoned because we've had a lot of that coming out to interject space too. However, in the craft that resonates, but there is some kind of poisoning energy about to come significant in Virgo's life, whoever you are and have that plus. Okay. Um, and obviously they are a snake. If they are, poisoning you or somebody you're connected to or they have done it in the past and it's a cold case energy maybe for some you're forensics and you're about to uncover the poisoning um if it is um deceased energy um however that resonates it could be food poisoning for some only you know you're showing anybody else but some kind of snake energy regarding poisoning i'll tell you that and the snake energy could be the third party energy too oh lord we're moving on Endurance. A particular Virgo is very, very, very strong. Someone didn't think you would last as long as you have been. For some, you're an alcoholic. They're trying to cover up the poisoning with your alcoholism it'd be very smart to go get lab test run oh i just said it would be smart to go get lab test run oh my god somebody i hope you're watching my videos virgo if you're not watching my videos and you are a virgo and you think this resonates with another virgo please share this with somebody that um you think this might apply with and i'm serious there is a virgo out there in the universe that's slowly being poisoned apparently and i didn't hear this in the gist in 96 but at least one of them is an alcoholic. But whoever is doing this, whether uh, it's somebody close to this Virgo, um, in the Gist of 96, it was a Virgo masculine. But I didn't hear the alcoholic part in the Gist of 96. But however that applies, somebody's an alcoholic and um, they're slowly poisoning you. Um, but they're trying to cover up the fact that you're an alcoholic with, and with the poisoning. So like, I think they were hoping when you pass away, it would just be from alcoholism and it wouldn't, um, maybe they're going to request not to do, I think they might be a spouse. I think they might be a spouse because whoever this is, I think they um, are not going to request an autopsy report when it ha when you actually go. Uh, I'm serious because they're going to be like, oh, well, they're an alcoholic. They passed away from alcoholic related um situation and blah you know they're not everybody knows they're alcoholic and blah 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 but in reality i think they're slipping something in your drink or your food because that was in uh, the gist of 96 too but you're very strong um lord have mercy somebody needs to be careful you're very strong virgo if this resonates for you masculine or feminine you're very strong somebody doesn't want you to know that now whether that's related to poisoning or not that's a message for one virgo you're very strong so somebody doesn't want you to know you're very strong um, I think they like to beat you down, beat you down with snake energy is what I think. Um, that's at least for one. For another one, you're being poisoned. Just saying, just saying. Um, I think it's in food and drink. Um, and you are an alcoholic. But somebody's trying to, um, they, I think they're doing this because they know you're an alcoholic. So when they, you pass away, they're going to be like, oh, well, you know, they're an alcoholic. There's really no need to run autopsy report or blase, blase, blase. Everybody knows they're an alcoholic like that. So I heard be smart to go get lab test run. Well, I just said that a few minutes ago in here. Uh, if you feel that message applies for you, Virgo, you can be masculine or feminine alcoholic. But if you feel something's off other than your alcoholism, I would be smart to go get some lab test run to see what the hell somebody's been slipping in your drink if or food if they are. Um, only you know your story, not anybody else. But this is the strength energy here. I feel alcoholic Virgo or per Virgo that is strong and people don't want you to know you're strong. You have lasted a lot longer in life or period than people thought that you would. So endurance energy, strength energy. Oh, my Lord. Third chakra, Archangel Camiel. This is the sacral chakra. That is sad right there. I mean, and it's all in the messages in the cards. And 
if you're the alcoholic Virgo and that resonates for you, I would really suggest checking out the gist in 96 of Virgo. I really, really would. I just did that one yesterday. Jesus. Sacral chakra. A particular Virgo has had severe GI issues. You're about to have even more severe GI issues. Be smart to go get lab tests drawn. That is double confirmation for lab tests, Virgo. Double freaking confirmation. Somebody needs to go get some lab tests drawn. Um, and I feel one of you guys is poisoning related. And one of you guys, you're an alcoholic. And somebody trying to cover it up through alcoholism. And I'm just being for real. Oh, my Lord. Um, okay, so the sacral chakra is your GI. It's your GI system. Stomach, gut area. I heard uh, one of you guys, whether you're the alcoholic that's being poisoned or just an G or just a Virgo that's having GI stomach issues. Um, you've apparently been having GI and slash stomach issues, but I heard that they're about to get worse. It'd be smart to go get lab tests drawn. So whether you're the alcoholic Virgo and somebody slowly poisoning you or just another Virgo that's having stomach issues, GI issues. However that applies in one's life, Virgo. Uh, this message applies for you. You're already having stomach issues. So, you know, that could be constipation. Um, that could be diarrhea. That could be um, stomach pain, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but some kind of GI issues, whatever that is and however that applies, um, I heard it'd be smart to go get lab test drawn. So, of course, the actions you take after this reading, that is you. You are the manifestor of your own destiny, not anybody else. Um, you can choose to listen to the downloads or not. However, that applies in one's life. For some, I think it could be stress-related, and I didn't hear that. I think it could be stress-related because you have some kind of snake energy in your energetic space, and it's causing you a lot of stress. I'm feeling for some of you guys. And I'm just being real, real. Whether it's a fire sign or another sign that's taking on the snake energy. Angel of divination. A particular vision is about to become very, very, very significant to a Virgo. Okay, this is what somebody doesn't want you to know. Um, I'm thinking, uh, okay, so a particular vision is about to become very significant to a Virgo. I'm thinking somebody doesn't want you to know this vision is about to become very significant to you. Um, but whoever you are, I feel you're highly, intel you're highly intelligent. I feel you're highly intuitive. I think you're going to know, to be honest that the vision is about to become very significant to you. Um, if you have a vision, and uh, if you have a vision and maybe you've never had one before, just know it's about to become very significant, um, if that message applies for you. Um, for some, I feel you are used to having visions. I think you are gifted. I think um, I think you're gifted for a lot of you guys. You have clairaudience, clairvoyance, which are the visions, psychic medium abilities, or dreamscape. I think you're used to getting them. Um, so I, I don't think it's going to be a surprise to you, but I, I heard it's about to become very significant to a Virgo, but they don't want you to know it is. So I think for one, you might start having visions and you never had them before. The clairvoyance energy. Um, I think maybe, um, a snake energy is going to try to trick you and think that you're hallucinating or it's, um, not natural or they're going to try to negatively down talk it, but, um, just know it's going to become very significant, um. In your life in some shape form or fashion i think it might be the spiritual war uh spiritual realm going to try to trying to warn you and maybe for some it might be about poisoning i didn't hear it was but i feel it might be about some of you guys and i'm serious i mean it is all up in here so divination in this situation is uh somebody's about to get a vision um the act of clairvoyance here if this resonates for you whether you are new to visions or whether you are not new to visions and you've Receive them for years. However, that resonates in one's life. But divination here is spiritual realm energy. You plug it in how it resonates. But I think somebody's going to try to downplay the vision. They're going to try to negatively get in your head and make you think it is nothing. But 
hopefully you watch this reading and you realize it'd be smart to heed the warning in this vision if this resonates for you and whoever this is for if this message applies for you when it comes up i don't think you're going to be taking um like shrooms to produce the vision i think you are going to be not taking shrooms not taking any kind of drugs and then the vision occurs is what i think oh my goodness angel of herald Someone is about to display through a statement in a workplace situation what really happened on a particular night within the past two weeks. It's about to completely be not what a Virgo said it was. It's going to create negative series of chain of events for this Virgo. Oh, my Lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. So in this aspect, Heralds is the statement energy. Um, it's the statement energy, speaking up energy. Um, I, however this applies in one's life, Virgo, I feel you could be high vibrational or low vibrational if that resonates for you. Either you were telling the truth or you were not telling the truth. But however that resonates in this, I heard it within the last two weeks. So it's already happened. This workplace situation, event, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, has already happened. It's happened within the last two weeks, if this resonates. But however this resonates, you could either have been telling the truth or not been telling the truth. But somebody else, I heard, is about to write a statement soon regarding the same exact event, Virgo, that it sounded like you were a part of, whether you want to be a part of it or not. But it's about to be complete opposite of what apparently you're telling your side of the story here. Um, so... I heard it's going to create negative series of chain of events for you. So um, you plug it in your own life, how it resonates, Virgo. Like I said, I feel you could either be telling the truth or not telling the truth, but how it resonates, somebody's about to discount basically everything you said on that night um, or morning or evening or day or what have you. And um, it's about to create negative series of chain of events for you. It's some kind of statement energy. It's uh, one of your coworker or coworkers, however that resonates. This is what somebody doesn't want you to know, that this other coworker is basically about to say everything opposite of basically what you said, um, if that resonates, okay? Let me see if I hear anything else. Oh, my goodness. And that could be the snake energy, too, for some of you guys. A teenage pregnancy is about to become significant in a t uh, Virgo's life. Okay, this is what somebody doesn't want you to know, uh, Virgo. A teenage pregnancy is about to become significant in a Virgo's life. So this could be, um, this is what well, obviously, I'm assuming the teenager doesn't want you to know or somebody you're connected, somebody's connected to this teenager. Um, I don't know if it's your teenager or somebody you're connected to is teenager, but somebody doesn't want you to know a teenage pregnancy um, is in the air or is about to be found out or what have you um how this resonates um for some i feel it could be your kid or somebody in your family's kid or somebody you're connected to's kid um some kind of teenage pregnancy energy however that resonates in one's life virgo all right we're done i hope this helped i love you guys so much and everybody made wonderful choices and namaste